good morning. It's about um, 8.30 in the morning, uh, sort of mid to late July. Um, just heading out on a, a short overnight hike uh, in the Royal National Park, which is just south of Sydney, Australia. Uh, I'm currently on the Kalu track, which will take me down to Kalu Pool, which is a very popular walking track because it's close to transport and quite easy. And then from Kalu Pools, I'm going to head up Kangaroo Creek, which is a probably a less popular track because it's quite overgrown. Um, apparently quite tricky to do sometimes. Should be pretty quiet, which is nice. So should hopefully have the place to myself uh, where I'll be hammock camping overnight and from there head back to waterfall so it's really just quite a short walk but um, yeah should be nice such a nice nice day today blue sky sunshine and uh, hopefully not too cold it's going to be I think about the top of 17 to 18 degrees today um, with probably a low of about five degrees overnight so that should be should be okay I'm just at the top of a ridge, just overlooking um, where Kalu Pools is. So Kalu Pools is just down there. Um, and then this is Kangaroo Creek running up here in Goodera Brook, just here. So basically I'll be heading down, down the uh, ridge, down to the base here, and then um, following Kangaroo Creek. Uh, but I'll probably head out to Bottle Forest Trail first, have a look down there, which is out that way and then come back and then go up to Kangaroo Creek and then Waterfall train station is up towards that way. That's Kangaroo Creek, where I'll be heading later today. Uh, but I've just arrived at um, uh, Kalu Pools, which is a popular swimming hole in summer. Um, not so popular in winter, because the water would be pretty cold. Um, but yeah, there's been a few people around this morning on the tracks, just uh, uh, probably heading down to Audley and just doing little day hikes, like myself. Um, yeah, but such a beautiful spot. The problem with being popular is that sometimes you get a bit of rubbish here but it's uh, looking pretty nice at the moment. Well, this is the end of the um, Bottle Forest Trail. Uh, it ends at this pool, which I think it's called Olympic, which is a yeah, pretty large pool. And um, so I was just sitting there having morning tea, relaxing, listening to the, well, listening to nothing really. It's so peaceful and quiet. Just a, a little waterfall over here, and then a couple of birds. So it was, uh, yeah, very relaxing. So now I'm heading back up the Bottle Forest Trail and uh, back to Kalu Pool. And then from there I'll follow up uh, Kangaroo Creek. So yeah, yeah it's beautiful. Okay, so I've just left um, Kalu Pool and I'm now yeah, following uh, Kangaroo Creek here on my right um, up to the, the next big water hole. Um, this track is uh, probably a little bit rougher than the other ones, so possibly a little bit harder to follow. Uh, it's a bit of bush, bush bashing, but um, yeah, should be a nice walk.
Well, I've been um, following kangaroo creep uh, for about two and a half hours now. Um, the track's kind of hard to follow, so if you lose sight of the track and end up in the bush, oh, it's hard, tough, scratchy, um, hard going. So you end up, yeah, really pushing through and getting stuck. But once you're on the track, it's not too bad. But um, yeah, sometimes the track just disappears. So uh, it's about three o'clock now, and I'm almost uh, towards the end of where I'm walking today. So hopefully I can get there and get set up uh, before the sun goes down. Oh, see ya. Well, I'm here at the water hole that I was aiming for, for today. So this is as far as I'm going along Kangaroo Creek uh, this afternoon. Um, next thing I'll head up into the bush a little bit and see if I can find a campsite where I can um, put my hammock up. I think I, could, I saw a, a clearing on Google Earth as far as I could tell so that's about 100 meters from here so I'll see if I can find that and then um, yeah get set up and yeah, have dinner. Well, I've made it to uh, where I'm camping tonight, which is just a kind of a rocky outcrop in the middle of very scrubby and very scratchy uh, terrain. Um, I've set up my hammock and I've just cooked some uh, mac and cheese for dinner, so I'm just eating that while I watch the sunset. So it's um, yeah, it's been a really good day. Uh, the um, the walk up uh, Kangaroo Creek was interesting. It was um, once you kind of lose sight of the track and you're going off track, oh, it gets really um, scratchy and hard work so I uh, yeah really uh, I'm all scratched up so it was uh, pretty hard going but once you're on the track it's not too bad but um, trying to keep an eye on the track because it just kind of peters out and disappears so it's um, it's hard going but uh, now I can just enjoy the peace and quiet of uh, the bush while I watch the sunset it's just about gone now Good morning. That's the view from my uh, bed this morning. Um, it's quite cool, cool overnight. Uh, managed to keep mostly warm, although my toes were quite cold all night. So I probably need to wear uh, two lots of woolen socks at bed at night. Um, but yeah, so it's about 6:30. Just listening to the birds and um, 
waiting for the sun to come up but I'll probably get up soon and have breakfast because I'm a bit hungry morning again. Um, I've had a pretty relaxing morning. I've packed up my stuff. Um, I wasn't intending on having a fire last night or this morning but my feet were so cold so I had a small fire just to warm them up and then I had to kind of let that burn right down because I didn't have much water to put it out so I just put it, let it go down to right just to ash and then um, yeah, put it out so leave no trace. A lovely morning here. I've just been sitting by the water hole. There's not a lot of water running through it at the moment. It's quite dry, so it probably doesn't look as nice as it would normally. But still, just listening to the frogs and the uh, um, the birds has been quite relaxing. So it's just nice to get out away from the hustle and bustle of the city and just enjoy the peace and quiet of the bush. Well, I've made it up to the next uh, water hole, which is probably the last water hole before the train station. Um, and I realised I didn't have my hot chocolate this morning, so I'm just cooking up the billy now to um, have my hot chocolate, and then um, then I'll head off. So. Well, that hot chocolate was fantastic. Um, great way to start the day. Um, so I'm now at the last water hole that I'll probably be stopping at. Um, I'm really only just a stone's throw from Waterfall train station. Um, so this is pretty much the end of my trip. So thanks for joining me and I'll see you next time.